Top 10 Things You Didn't Know About Tiwa Savage Hello Dispirers, welcome back to another exciting video and thanks for watching. In today's video, we are taking you into the entertainment industry and shining a light on one of its most prolific female singers in Africa, Tiwa Savage. Tiwa Tope Savage, born 5th February 1980, known professionally as Tiwa Savage, is a Nigerian singer, songwriter and actress born in Esale Eko. She began her music career doing backup vocals for artists while she was in London and after she returned to Nigeria, she made an appearance on the Marvin's 2012 compilation album Solar Plexus after being signed to the label. Her debut studio album Once Upon a Time was released on 3rd July 2013. It was supported by seven singles, Kele Kele Love, Love Me, Without My Heart, Ife Wagbona, Fularin, Olurimi and Eminado. The album was nominated for Best Album of the Year at the 2012 Nigeria Entertainment Awards and for Best R&B Pop Album at the Headlines 2014. Savage's second studio album, R.E.D., was released on 19 December 2015 and yielded two singles, My Darling and Standing Ovation. In June 2016, Savage signed a management and publishing deal with Rock Nation. In September 2017, she released her debut EP Sugar Cane with songs from the EP like R.E.D. and Sugar Cane which have both been nominated at the Nigeria Entertainment Awards. In November 2018, Savage won Best African Act of the 2018 MTV Europe Music Awards, becoming the first woman to win that category. Savage sings in English and Yoruba. Her music is a blend of Afrobeats, R&B, Pop and Hip Hop. Savage's contributions to the Nigerian music industry have earned her several awards. She has been involved in youth empowerment and breast cancer screening projects and has raised funds to build schools in Nigeria. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. Let's take a closer look at this beautiful and talented singer with 10 things you didn't know about Tiwa Savage. Number 1. Tiwa Savage participated in UK's X Factor. The X Factor is a British television music competition to find new singing talent. The third series was broadcast on ITV from 19th August 2006 until 16 December 2006. Tiwa Savage participated in the X Factor UK in 2006 and made it to the final 24 before she was disappointingly dropped. Her time on the show was a great boost to making her believe in herself. Number 2. Her following on social media is massive. Tiwa Savage is one of the most followed African celebrities on Instagram. She has millions of followers that are constantly checking up and checking in to see what's going on in her career and her life and she stays pretty active on there. Some might be kind of loath to give up this kind of personal time but some people do seem to enjoy it. She has over 10 million followers on Instagram and over 3.5 million followers on Twitter. Number 3. Tiwa is currently signed to Universal Music Group. Inspired by the growth of the Nigerian music industry, Savage moved back to Nigeria and signed with Marvin Records in 2012. But in May 2019, she announced her record deal with Universal Music Group and exit from Marvin Records. Aisha Salaudin from CNN covered this tidbit as it was shown that Tiwa signed with UMG in a huge deal that could elevate her status beyond what she's already enjoyed so far in her career. This is one of those momentous days that a person will likely look back on in their lives and hold sacred as the day that their fortune changed for the better. Number 4. Her current net worth is estimated at $5 million. With so many singles, albums, movies, endorsement deals and being brand ambassador to several big brands, Tiwa has accumulated significant wealth for herself. She's worth over $5 million but after her recent deal with Universal Music, she's probably worth more. The hard-working lady has distinguished herself from her peers and the 40 years old is still starting as there are no signs of her slowing down. Number 5. She was the first African female to sign with Pepsi. One of Africa's most followed women on social media, Tiwa Savage was the first African female to represent Pepsi as an ambassador and represents leading global brands including Nike, Mega Growth Hair, MTN and Starbeer. Being first for anything is something of an honor since it indicates that you've accomplished something and set a standard that other people will either follow or at least recognize in some way. Whether this accomplishment will gain that much notice in the years to come remains to be seen. This African diva has been first at so many deals both nationally and internationally. Number 6. She once worked in a bank. Savage graduated with a degree in accounting from the University of Kent and started working at the Royal Bank of Scotland. She worked in the Royal Bank of Scotland while working on her album. She soon realized that she wanted to concentrate on her career and hence left the bank to concentrate on her music career. 
Number seven, when she was 11, her family moved to London. Her family relocated to London when she was 11 years old in search for her education. This was a big switch from Lagos and forced her and her family to undergo a lot of changes to their lifestyle. But it's just as obvious that they did adapt and things did work out since she studied hard and applied herself in a way that really allowed her to rise above any and all challenges in her life. While attending secondary school, she was a trombone player for her school's orchestra band. From a good time with a good career in the corporate world to a successful music career, Tiwa is definitely a force to reckon with. Number 8. She has lent her vocals to many international stars. Tiwa Savage is noted for her tender vocals which are very soothing and unique in its own way. This has caught the attention of any artist worldwide right from a young age. She did backup vocals for George Michael when she was 16 and also lent vocals to other musicians such as Mary J. Bleak, Shaka Khan, Blue Cantrell, Emma Bunton, Kelly Clarkson, Andrea Bocelli and Miss Dynamite. George Michael was, before his unfortunate passing, one of the hottest stars around back in the day and was also one of those that people still revered once he started getting older as someone that was deserving of respect. Number 9. She had a failed marriage. Tiwa got married to her former manager T. Bills in April 2014 and by 2015 they had a son. But unfortunately her husband accused her of infidelity and her mother of witchcraft and things only went downhill from there. These rumors and accusations after circulating gave the African diva a bad girl reputation which watered down the sweet girl charisma she came into music with. Tiwa did debunk her husband's claims of infidelity, but unfortunately the marriage just kind of fell apart after a while. She has been recently linked to Whiskey in recent years which has been raising much dust because of their age difference, but the rumored lovebirds have told fans that age is just a number. Number 10. She's performed on stage with some very notable stars. With a career that has spanned over a decade and performing at sold out tours, Tiwa has shared the stage with some very big names in music and has been holding her own throughout for a good long while now so it's fair to assume that her confidence level is rather high and she knows what she's doing when it comes to singing with another musician. She has performed all over the world in countries which include USA, the UK and many more. Hello Explorers, we hope you learned a thing or two about Tiwa Savage as a little reward for watching all the way to the end. Here is an extra fact about Tiwa Savage. Number Many ridiculed her at the start of her career. She had to deal with a lot of ridicule from people who thought she wouldn't make it. Sadly, this is part of a lot of life when it comes to trying to be the best you can be. People who are either envious, jealous or just plain spiteful for one reason or another will attempt to keep you down and convince you that whatever you do is not good. That kind of negative feedback has claimed to many artists that might have gone on to do something with their lives. But thankfully, Tiwa didn't take any of this to heart. Her voice was criticized as well as her talent as an entertainer, but her confidence is what she says got her through. So there you have it, Explorers, the top 10 things you didn't know about Tiwa Savage. If there is a topic you would like Explorers to cover, leave a comment in the comment section and we will do well to grant your request. Also, if you did enjoy this video, do well to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe and share with your friends.